So EVA2 on flight day six, Mike and Comrade are gonna be going outside. Uh, the first task that they're gonna be doing, um, it's gonna be installing a European payload out onto the Columbus module. Uh, both crew members are gonna be going to the payload bay. Um, Comrade is gonna be retrieving this European payload, taking it to Columbus. Mike is gonna retrieve um, two right angle drives and bring those inside. And he is also gonna retrieve a guide post, um, which will be installed into the airlock. And that is needed for um, for a task on EVA-3. So it's seeing them on a Columbus right now. Uh, this, this antenna, we call it a, it's a gator assembly, and it's basically uh, two antennas that are gonna clamp onto a handrail. So Mike is gonna go ahead and plug this assembly in, and then he's gonna take wire ties and route the cable all along those handrails to secure it down, while Comrade is gonna take um, the antennas and actually attach them to the handrail. So the two different antennas we have, one of them um, is for tracking ships and, and vessels and such. Uh, the other antenna is a amateur radio antenna, an Aris ham radio. Uh, we do have um, a couple of those already on station. So once that task is complete, uh, both crew members together are gonna head on out to S1 where they are going to be relocating a stanchion and an instrument we call um, the FPMU. Uh, this instrument, it's, it measures the difference of potential energy across the station. And so on a future flight, um, there will be some interference to some payloads on there, so we need to, to relocate it out to um, P1. Also, uh, for the robotics in our EVA-3, for for this flight, uh, there would be some interference if we did not relocate this, uh, this instrument. Once that is complete, both crew members head on out to S3, and we are gonna be deploying yet another one of the payload attached systems. This one is the Zenith inboard, um, and all of this is very similar to the other PAS deploys that we'll be doing. Um, they just removed a diagonal brace. You can see the a yoke coming out, bringing the pallet up. They'll reinstall that diagonal brace and then um, secure the yoke down onto structure. And this deploy um, is for a future flight. So once that payload attached system um, is deployed, both crew members are going to be installing a WEDA antenna, which is a wireless video system. So while the crew members are out EVA, they do have cameras on top of their helmets. And this antenna is for, um, for that uh, transmission. And once that WEDA is complete, um, that completes the scheduled content that we have for EVA 2.